Hello, I'm Dr. Alan Partridge, Adobe eLearning Evangelist. I wanted to tell you a little bit more about Adobe Presenter 8, specifically about Adobe Presenter Video Creator, and give you some ideas about best practices for editing your videos that you created in Adobe Presenter Video Creator. Let's take a look here at the screen. So you can see here uh, that this is an example of Adobe Presenter Video Creator editing in action. You can see that when you look at the basic interface, you can actually see what's going on. You click on the play button and the shuttle commands to move through the navigation. Now, yellow means you and green means the screen. When you click on one of those buttons, green for example, or blue for example in this case, you'll move to a different view. Just click anywhere in the timeline that you want to change that view, and then click the button to make it change to the view that you desire. So if you'd like a shot of yourself, just click the yellow button. If you'd like a shot of both yourself and something, then choose the blue button and so on. In addition to that, you can adjust those shots by using the zoom tool. You'll find the zoom tool as a magnifying glass and then just take the zoom tool and stretch the little marquee around either the image of yourself or the image of the video on the stage. It's a good idea to zoom in tight on images of yourself that you use in the blue section, the both section. That way the image of yourself side by side with the video will be large and people will be able to see it clearly. It's also a good idea to remember to zoom back out to a wide shot when you use a shot just of yourself alone. Those shots are much larger and they'll get a little bit grainy if you're zoomed all the way in. So you wanna keep those ideas in mind. Now it's also possible to cut out parts of your video. Click on the scissors to crop out a section of your video. Click on set in point where you want to begin cutting out the video. Then move your mouse over to the section where you want to stop cutting out the video and then click set out point in order to cut the video. Everything between the in point and the out point will automatically be removed from your video. Here's a great tip for doing that with video. You want to avoid jump cuts. So don't cut video that goes directly from a shot of your face saying one thing to another shot of your face saying something entirely different. The, the viewer will notice that you've moved and that sort of thing. So generally speaking, you want to go from a shot of yourself, full screen, then to a shot of what was on the screen being captured wherever there is a cut. You'll also want to remember that as you're recording, if you make a mistake, just pause and give some space. It'll be easier for you to do those edits in the long run. So as you can see, it's very simple to work with the various editing tools inside of Adobe Presenter Video Creator. Uh, it's a lot of fun. It's easy to get started. I'd encourage you to go ahead and give it a shot today.